What's going on dudes, boys and girls, friends and viewers, people who I do know and those I still do not. My name is Carlos Hals, welcome back to another Subnautica video. Um, I was going to do the forest, as, as that's the only game that I've kind of abandoned for a while. But the, the episode I recorded was just boring and like me chopping down wood and just talking about random stuff and I just don't want to post that. So instead, we're going to go to an island today. Um, I went exploring and there are two islands. You can see them very, very well. You see there's a like a very big cloud right there. That cloud covers an island, and that's the same thing with this right there. This is a this is an island as well. You can see it's a little bit different than the um, than the background um, sky. You can see there's a little like a kind of border around it. You can see it's just something is it's it's something is covered in there. So we're gonna go to this one right there. Uh, is it is going to have I think I mean, I mean we're gonna see what's there, but I still haven't seen it. But I'm just, I'm just, I'm just wondering. That's probably going to have a lot of stuff. Before we go, though, I do need one more fish, so I can. Uh, do I cleared out all the fish around me? God damn! I'm just, I'm just a hungry motherfucker. All right, so I'm gonna get a, probably a boomerang or something. Come here. There we go. We're gonna cook that. We're gonna cook that. What? Did I, did I let it go? Oh my god! I let it go. Okay. I think I double clicked. That's why. Come here, boomerang. No, yeah, there we go. Nope, don't attack me. Don't attack me. There we go. Okay. Oh, our Seamoth is ready and waiting. Hopefully, there's gonna be something awesome there. I'm, I'm just, I'm just curious. I'm just curious to see, curious to, to know. Also, before we go, we're gonna listen to a communication uh, ray, uh, ray, relay. There we go. Okay, let's craft that cooked fish. We're gonna carry it with us for now, and let's listen to the message. Gatrupa flyera glaflagor. Okay. That was a good message. I. Great. I yeah. I I know what to do. I know where to go. All right. So I'm gonna take my sea moth. Why do you shoot your balls at my sea moth? I don't understand. So where do we go? Wait, did, did, did these move? They're closer to my base, as I remember. Wait, is it floating? Or am I just... I think it might be floating. Can I push it? I can push it? I didn't know I can push it. Does it float? Can like can stuff push it? That's weird. I didn't know that. There's another message. What? Damage life pot system? That is weird. Maybe I damaged it by um I damaged it by hitting it, maybe? I don't know. There's another relay. Sunbeam broadcasting to all survivors of the Aurora. We've covered more than half the distance, so hold on in there. We're scanning the planet for dry land as we speak. You couldn't have picked a less convenient parking spot. But we'll be in touch as soon as we have a landing site for you. Sunbeam out. Okay. So they're looking for the landmass where they can land. Should be awesome because they're also looking for a landmass for me. Anyway, uh, I do have a locker. I build a locker where to kind of store my stuff, just so I can prepare for the um, just for the you know for the journey. If I find a lot of stuff there, you know, on on the island, I'm gonna need some storage room. So we're we gonna go this way. Give me a second, guys. So we're going there. Okay. Let's go. We do have, we do only have thirty percent on our sea moth, which is kind of scary. Not sure what happens when you run out. Um, I still do not have the moon room. I, I mean, I don't. I don't even have a base. You know what I mean? There we go. There comes the lag. Hi, Reefback. How's it going, friend? Their lag is just atrocious, bro. Atrocious. How's it going, friend? 
But how have you guys been? I've been I've been okay. I've been trying to kind of struggling to record a little bit. My recordings haven't been going that well recently. Um, so here is something. I don't I don't know what's there. This is just like just terrible. Fix your please. Fix your game, please. Although it's very very enjoyable, please fix the um, the the issues that it has. Oh, you can you can, you can already see it. You can already see. It. I'm not sure if there's any dangers in here though. Are there like any Goliathans here or uh, so not the Goliaths, the Leviathans? There's the island. It is actually all uncovered now. We are getting very close, and I think we can kind of see it. Yes, we can see it. Oh my! Wait, so it's not it doesn't actually touch the ground, guys? It doesn't touch the ground. What are these things? These balls? What the hell are they? Are those the ones that keep it afloat? I don't know. It's, it looks weird, but it looks, it looks super cool. Alright, so it looks like they... Oh, God. Here's um, a place I can land, so let's get out of it. Alright, stay here. I'll be back in a second. Well, not a second, but a little, in a little while. Actually, you know what? I, I, I don't know if it actually preserves the, the, the power, but let's hope it does, because I just, just turned off the light to be a little bit more... Um, power efficient, but anyway, look at this. We are on an island. We are on a dry land right now. And this looks super cool. We actually at the back of the aurora. can see the aurora there. Let's, uh, let's keep going. Let's actually pull out a scanner. Because I think I th just, we just have to scan everything that's here. We've not been here yet. And where are we going? Some trees. These are weird looking. It's awesome though. Can I scan these? I can't. Can I scan this? Can I scan? Oh, I can scan these. Voxel shrub. New alien form. Pick up multiple faint and energy signatures on the surface on, of the island. Okay. So these are faint energy sources. That's fine. A speckled rattler. That's another thing we just discovered. What are these? Grub Busket. Alien life form. Awesome. This. Bulba tree. Oh, I already have that? What? Looks cool though. Oh, looks like there's a base right there. Is there radiation? Because I'm hearing a little bit like like of a crackling noise or something like that. Dude, this looks amazing. Jaffa Cup. I mean, this game is just beautiful. The, like the way it's done. The only thing they have to just nail down right now is just keep working on the creatures of the, you know, maybe make them move a little bit more realistically. I think. Like some of them just move move perfect, but like the Reaper Goliath, and he's just kind of like a. I mean, he's kind of a snake, but he also like turns weirdly in the water. I don't know what it is, but um, and then also on the optimization of the game. Once they Ming plant, Li Ming is that Li Ming from the Heroes of the Storm? <laughs> um, once they get that done, holy shit, this game is gonna be like one of the best games out there, actually. Like they, it has just so much stuff, and it's still next, it's still in early access. All right, pink cup, just come everything. Okay, where are we going? We have to get there somehow, somehow at some point. Um, because there's an observatory there. I wonder if I can scan the observatory to actually, so I can build it for my base. Something I'm really, really curious of. Let's see, if, is there anything here? Can't see it. There aren't uh, an, any animals here, so maybe animals could be something they could work on as well. I mean, it is kind of like an uh, island which... Oh shit, what the... F I think just I think that thing just what I think it just jumped at me. It just jumped at me. Where is it? Okay, we're gonna fight it. What? You what, mate? Ye ye, you didn't know, but I'm a Heroes of the Storm master. Well, platinum, but <laughs> okay, he's running away. That's fine. Dude, this guy this guy jumps crazy. Alright, let's pull out our, uh, our scanner again. 
Let's see. Where are we going? Where are we going? Anything here? It's like this is another beach where I could have landed, but I've landed on a different beach. Oh my god. Okay. The lag, is gone. the lag is gone. See, if the lag would be constant, I knew it would be my computer. Something wrong with my computer, but I, I, can, I cannot hear my graphics card going. Yeah, my graphics card wasn't even, um, wasn't like the 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 fan program, you know, the, the special curve for the fan, which I have set up, wasn't even turned on and it wasn't even working that hard at all. So, where are we going? Like, where is this leading us? I can pick this up, which I think is actually farming in this game, so I will be able to um, basically pick those guys, pick those guys up at some point and also plant them, maybe in my future base if I want to. Where is this leading me? Is this leading me to the the observatory, or what am I going? This doesn't look good. This doesn't look good. I don't think I can walk up there. Can I just casually walk up there? I don't think so. Where is this leading me then? All right, let's just get back down here. Huh. Okay, let's go this way. See what's up this way. Uh, some more plants, which I've already scanned, so not gonna be useful though. But I wonder how can I walk up there? Like it looks like a very steep walk. There might be like a path somewhere, but where am I? <laughs> it's also gonna get a, a pretty dark soon, so I need to be. I need to be. Um... Kind of like fast about my exploration of, of this island. Nothing here, okay. I did prepare. I did prepare water, so um, just because I I, pr I knew that I probably won't have access to like bladder fish and stuff from here, so I just kind of prepared with some uh, with some water. I do have it in my inventory. We can actually drink some now. Oh, it's decomposing. It's fine. It's gave me. It gave me some. Give me some of the food. Okay. Keep walking. Keep walking. Looks like we were making our way towards that observatory right there. There's one on this one as well. I think so. So are, are there a couple of observatories? Or I'm, or I'm just... Or am I just uh, crazy? Oh! What is that? A lantern tree? This looks crazy. A lantern fruit. Huh. I can eat it? Oh, I dropped it. God damn it. Oh, it gives me food and water. There's so many of these here, though. I don't think I'm going to die of... Um... They're pretty big, though, as well. So, I wonder if I can um, if I can plant these. Warning. Blood loss detected. Blood what? Blood loss? Maybe I, will, I ate a little bit too much? Yeah, maybe I ate a little bit too much. Okay, there's... um. I heard that fucker again. Then there's one in there. Yes, there's one in the actual base. So look at that. That's actually an old base. I was here before. M marble melon? Let me scan that. Marble melon. I wonder if I can grow these. I wonder if I can... Uh... Oh, exterior grow bed. So we, now we have an exterior grow bed. A Chinese potato. Dude, so many things. I can pick up. I have to fight these, uh, I have to fight this. Purple artifact? What is that? It looked weird, but... Alright, so it is nighttime, so we're not gonna be seeing as much as before. It says, it says I can scan these. Living wall. 
Okay. Scan the living wall. Multi-purpose room. Nice. I'll be actually able to build that now. So we can actually start building our base. We do have a multi-purpose room right now. Um, so base building will be something we can do right now. Which is awesome. That's what I was waiting for. Like I was waiting to just start building my base. Like that what I was very, very... Something I was really... Okay, there's one there. Bulkhead? Oh, okay, that's a bulkhead. I think that's... A... See that fucking spider? Like it's, it's just looking for me right now. It's looking for me while I'm scanning. Okay. Let's fight it. Come on, man. This guy, this guy has a... He's just... <laughs> what the fuck? He's like, he's like flipping and shit. He's like, yeah. Yeah, man. Are you gonna fight me or are you gonna... I think I killed it. Yeah, I killed it with fire. That's legit. I can't even scan these. Okay, that's fine. I mean, I'm not mad. I think we can enter this door from... Oh, oh a spotlight? Whoa, 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 where was that? I saw, oh, there we go. There's a spotlight right here. Nice, nice, so that's the spotlight we'll be able to build again. Whoa. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Anything to scan here? Yeah, that's a living wall which I already scanned uh, right there somewhere. Uh, here's a crate, which has a f first aid kit, which is, I guess not bad if we lose health to this. Uh, okay, we have to prepare for a fight. Where is it? Oh, you got stuck. You got him. Alright. Good. Abandoned PDA. Paul Torgo's log. Where is it? Oh, there we go. Um, Captain... Captain's log. Five weeks since our ship uh, the Degasi was shot down. I gave thanks to the fate. Excuse me. I gave uh, I give thanks that fate saw fit to spare my son Bart and I from death. But my personal and Turich were not so distant. The only other survivor was Marguerite Maida, a cat price mercenary with local expertise, who I reluctantly commissioned for the journey. We spent days in, in, in the life bar, the rain beating on the roof, nothing but ocean on the horizon. Just as we are losing hope, the weather cleared and we saw this island, this the, this floating oasis. We were saved. We salvaged the Degasi wreck down to its bare bones and built this habitat from the scrap. I set Bart uh, to studying the alien plant life and arranging as a stable source of food. But extensive dig digi-training to good use. People can question digi-training and foreign technology all they like. Bart's biochem imprint already paid for itself. As I indicate this, I'm eating a hydroponically grown potato salad garnished with seeds that taste like spicy orange peel. Our only problem is Maida. I've caught her muttering that the island's too small to support us indefinitely, that the weather's going to turn on us. I, I say she's grown superstitious. Every judgment she makes assumes things go bad or to, from bad to worse. Uh, that the only uh, the only forward is a fight. She ought to make in some context. As a species, we've spent millennia learning how to shackle nature to our will. This planet won't cause us any new problems. Our new task now is stay alive as, uh, as comfortably as possible until a rescue arrives. In this part of space, that could be months or even years. Okay. That's interesting. So a little bit of a storyline. A battery, nice. I, I'm definitely gonna enjoy a battery. Can I scan anything here, boys and grills? Any anything to scan up here? No, is that is that everything that it is that everything that is scanned now? It seems like it. Right, awesome. So we can actually get out of here and it's actually morning time again, so we will be able to see where we're going. Um where are we going now? There's a little Okay, so I think there's a little path from actually this base leading up to Clean Me. Okay, let's go this way. And let's actually go this way. 
maybe let's go this way see if there's oh yeah there's something there there is something there there's something there and something there we're gonna go there in both okay so let's take a look i can hear something i can hear the sea quite loudly i'm not sure why but because i'm very far away oh no, sorry it actually might be with the wind <laughs> Uh, the sound for that is very similar. That looks really nice. We might build a base actually at some point on this island. I'm just, uh, I'm just, I'm just curious to see how, uh, how different it is than building it. You know, building it uh, in the sea itself. Uh, there's a supply. There's another PDA here. That's log number three. So we're not gonna le read it. We're gonna go to the other one and pick up number two, which is probably where it is. Oh my god! Indoor grow bed. That is awesome. Fern palm. I think we're gonna have to change the battery soon. And this is only a fifty percent observatory. That's what I'm saying, dude. You can act. I can actually scan it to actually get. The, uh, the observatory and I'll be able to build it now awesome this is amazing guys it's just amazing there's a lantern so can I eat it again oh fuck I dropped it come here okay I'm not gonna eat too much of it just because I know I know what happened the last time I ate it but okay awesome so this is an observatory um, is there anything else I can really scan here? I don't think so. Doesn't look like it. I already have a spotlight, so this spotlight is not going to do any good to me. No, it doesn't doesn't seem like I can scan anything anything more. That's okay though. It's okay. We we have one more right there. So um, I think right there we're gonna actually read both of our logs just because I think the other one actually hides the second one. If it doesn't, then we're gonna have to look for it, man. We have to find it. Because we gotta know the storyline of this island. This one doesn't look too different than the other one. I think these guys just kind of like basically made some outposts on the island itself. And um, I mean, this island could easily sustain these guys. Like you, you can see how big it is. Is that is that a bird? Dude, these are birds. Is that what I think so? That's a crazy looking bridge. If you fall off of that, you fall right into jaws of a, a Reaper Goliath, a Reaper Leviathan. Actually, I don't, I, I don't know if there are any Leviathans are there uh, around this island. I can hear something. I don't know what it was. Look at the back of the Aurora. It looks so beautiful. This ship must have been so beautiful when it was actually functional. Okay, so where are we going? I think we're going this way. We need to get upstairs. Yes, this is the upstairs way. This is the upstairs way, the way, the only way up. I don't know why I'm talking with this accent. Don't listen to me. Dude, this bridgeway is actually pretty scary. Holy moly. I wonder if I wonder if, if there's any fall damage in this game. Something I'm really curious of. It's it's just crazy to me how open this game is and how like you know how much detail was actually put in the game the actual depths of the sea there's everything that's, there is to, to see about this okay so plant pot i can i can have a plant pot that's nice i mean there's nothing pretty much in it a small marble melon can i eat that i can indeed god damn it chinese potato no, I don't want to pick up. I want to pick up the marble melon. Uh, there we go. Let's see how this how much this gives me. A little bit. A little bit. Ooh, the, the giant potato actually gives me a lot. I wonder if I pick those up, will I be able to plant these? And there's the PDA. I already have the desk. I already have the, the chair as well. So I don't think I can scan anything in here. It looks like that's going to be it for the actual island. We can actually start building our base now. And I'm pretty happy about it. Uh, super happy about it, actually. I don't, but the only thing right now is that I don't know where to build it. All right, let's, let, let's read those PDAs. Um, data bank and 
Tegasi Lois voice lock. Tegasi lock. The, the, the. Oh, that's Bart. Okay. <sighs> can I play it? I probably can't. Margaret, it won't work, Chief. Uh, there's nothing left for Degasi. No building materials on this island, and my nose tells me the weather's turning. We gotta have to. We have to get our feet wet. This island's safe. There are no predators. We can grow food. Why would we abandon it? Your kid says we can't grow enough. Not without more grow beds. Uh, speak up, good. But it's it's true. The natural growth uh, rates are too slow to support t t three of us indefinitely, especially if the weather uh, gets worse. All I'm saying is, uh, oceans gets uh, got us surrounded. No, no use hiding. It's my decision. To you two want to forfeit your commissions, you, you take a swim. Believe me, I'm thinking on it. Bart, I said no. Your life is worth uh, more than your vegetable patch. I forbid you to go out in the in the storm. I stopped needing your permission when the ship you were co captaining sunk. You'll stop needing my permission the day I'm not your father. Say, chief. Say, chief. Chief, what? Do you know how to drain these grow beds out there of 40 tons of storm water? Or how to conjure food from air? Don't try to be clever. No one likes a clever mercenary. I'm just saying, what's your boy's life worth to uh, to you today? If next week you're going to be so hungry, you, you start wondering uh, what he tastes like. What? Let him go deal with the plants. Son, go deal with the plants. Bart, Toil is no longer aboard the habitat. Interfere with my family again, and when a rescue arrives, I will leave you here. You understand me? No rescue coming, Chief. Not in time. And no uh, and no staying here, neither. This rain keeps falling, and sooner or later, this place will be buried. Only choice we've got is whether we get buried with it. Stay away from my boy. I messed up badly this time. It's been two days since uh, since what happened. We should have left this island. We never should have left this island. I should have listened to them. Uh, we should have gone so. We should have gone so deep. We're not wanted down there. They don't trust us. I knew it, and I didn't say. I couldn't see it, and they couldn't. And now they're stuck down there, and I'm up here alone. I deserve this. Okay. So it looks like. Um, Okay, let's, let's save here. So what happened? They, they actually did leave the island. It looks like I'm, I'm just missing one PDA, but I'm not sure where it is. I'm not sure where the f it is. Maybe it's somewhere here. I'm just missing it. Maybe it's just lying here somewhere, but I'm just like, I'm stupid. I'm not, mi I'm not missing it. No, I don't think so. I don't think I'm missing anything. But um, yeah, so it looks like the, the land on, they landed on this island and then they left it because they thought that... Uh, Um, they felt that they can't sustain themselves on this island. But it looks like they were fine. Fine, for at least for the time being. You know what I mean? Uh, where's my Seamoth? It's right there. Yeah. We're going to go back to our Seamoth. We're going to go back home, I think. And then in the next episode, we will be able to start building our base. Which is awesome. So excited. Uh, we have the outside row bed. We have the inside row bed. Everything is just awesome, but I think they just moved somewhere. You know what I mean? Let me actually go uh, to this one. Let me go to this base again. Maybe there's a PDA which I missed somewhere um, because it looks like we're missing just one PDA. Um, but it doesn't look like it. it doesn't seem like I there's anything down here. There's, there was only that one PDA and that was it in this base. At least in this part, I guess part of the base because they had three. Yeah, there, there was a PDA here and that was it. Hmm. That's weird. I thought there would be more. Maybe let's pick up some of those lantern fruit so we can kind of plant these as well. If I could, that would be awesome. Let's actually go this way. Maybe there's something here that I'm still missing. Oh, looks like I think there's a PDA right here. I th yes, there is. There's a PDA right, lying right here. The gassy voice log number three, the aftermath. Okay. So this is continuing with this one. You see, Chief, you brought us to this sodden planet. 
you told uh, us we'd see a lush payday. Now what do we get? G uh, some six weeks later, most of crew dead, a pile of dirt in our front room, rain coming in through the windows, food destroyed. I suppose you, uh, with the extensive experience of hitting people in the face, you'd make much better captain. I know I'd, uh, I'd start by uh, not taking on schedule of the tour by alien water worlds. That's something you never want to learn the hard way. Let's hear then, what's your plan? I have a site scouted out. It's a cave a couple hundred meters down. Lots of lithium deposits, good for building. How do you imagine we'd live? I figured two water filters would keep the three of us going. We could build a bioreactor to cover the power. Chief will eat sea seaweed salad if that's what it takes. Or uh, You got something better? Send the coordinates to my PDA. I'll review your proposal. There's a boba tree. Okay, so um, I mean, I guess, I guess that that's where they moved. They moved like two hundred meters down. Um, they they actually did they actually get that signal from that or? No, I didn't. That's fine though. That's fine though. Got them. I dropped it. I keep dropping stuff rather than eating it. Like these vegetables are good just because. Um, Maybe there's just something more on this island. Maybe I'm just missing something. Now let's go back to the, maybe actually on the path, there will be like maybe a PDA just lying down then somewhere. Like there was last time in that cave. Life path four. Looks like it ends here. There's nothing here, honestly. Okay. Keep going this way. Um, so I guess we will be able to maybe um, get to their base underground. That would be pretty awesome. Dude, like finding their base in, in the underground would be freaking amazing, I think. Let's go this way. Let's see what's up here. Nothing. No more PDAs as well. I think that's it for the PDAs. I mean, I'm still missing like a couple. But I'm not sure where they are. Maybe they're just underground. Maybe maybe actually in the bay in the underwater base. Oh, the, here's the the crazy bridge that they had. Dude, this is a <laughs> that is scary. There's some scary stuff. All right, okay. It's weird that you don't see this. Um, you don't see this like not bridge, but this island from anywhere. Oh. Oh my god, there's some more grow beds here. A lot of grow beds. Some, some marble melons. Uh, a lot of Chinese potatoes. Dude, they had more than enough, right? They had more than enough. Can I scan these? I've already scanned it, so it's all good. Um, I don't see any, any PDA though, so... No further um, unraveling. Is that a PDA? No, I don't think so. I think that's it. I think that's it. Let's get back to our trusty Seamoth. Our good old trusty Seamoth. Actually, it's not, it's not that old, actually. What am I talking about? I think we're getting pretty close. Okay, okay. I can see my life path from here, and there's my Sima. Alright guys, thank you guys for watching today's episode. I really do hope you enjoyed it. We explored so much this beautiful island behind us. So much new stuff, and then we can actually start building our base. So next episode, we're gonna, we're gonna find a spot where we can build our base. Not sure where that's gonna be yet. Oh, here's how you're back. How's it going, friend? Hi. You gonna say bye to the viewers? Um, so, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.